Richmond has a huge underground skate scene. Huge. Some of the best spots, some of the best skaters. But if you're not hip, you won't know. Cats want to get documented. They want to see it, because style matters. It's more, hey, you mind if I capture this? Yeah, for sure. You mind if I take this photo? Yeah, for sure. Just let me get warmed up and go ahead. Just so much freedom in skateboarding. You could honestly be who you are. You could see a bunch of cats in this kind of like different worlds. But you throw a skateboard in the midst of that, it's so much freedom in a piece of wood. So much freedom. That's why, to me, skateboarding is democracy. I always had this thought of like showing the world through my eyes. I can't afford a camera. So I got an iPhone, and then I got into street photography, and then I was like, yo, this is lit, just capturing a moment as it comes. And then naturally, as, as our creative view, you, you get one tool, then you want another tool. So then I just start buying cameras, and then I just start learning about other types of photography, long exposures and things like that. I just really navigated towards street black and white photography. It just tells a story to me. I get a lot of inspiration of like clothing, like fashion, like street, like you know what I mean? So like just seeing how an outfit's put together, I'm like, yo, I like that. It's more of what just stands out to me. Whenever I see movement, colors, shapes, and shadows, the shadows help tell a story. And that's what I'm all about, telling a story. I'm sensitive of my creativity. Photography, it's a real battle for me. Um, but I just have to push myself to, okay, Nate, that's just your anxiety. Just be creative. Just create something. I have to feel it. If I don't feel it, I just, I won't capture it. I have friends be like, Nate, you should capture that. That's a dope photo. I always say, you seen it, you capture it. That's not my photo, that's your photo. Take a photo of that. You know what I mean? Here's my camera. Capture it. We just live in a fake society, yo. We're so brainwashed. We're so conditioned. Especially in America culture, it's kind of conditioned to white experience, black experience, poor experience, rich experience, you know what I mean? I think for me, skateboarding breaks down that social conditioning and it's just like, this is who I am and then you start to see outside of social conditioning we all got a lot in common remove race sex whatever remove the character that we project remove this you know what I mean Pre present that child that's still inside of us and we all trying to figure it out but for me the skate community gives me a Dog, you're trying to figure out what well, this is what I did. Oh, snap. Yo, this is, this person helped me do this. Oh, snap. I went through this, and this is what I could learn from other people's journeys. So for me, it's like no matter what's going on in the world, you get your feet on that board and you're free. And if you don't skate, you get your hands on the drumsticks, you get your hands on the DJ booth, you know what I mean, or the turntables. You get your hands on the spray paint. And no matter what's going on, it's democracy and all of that, because you're going to have a, a group of like-minded individuals who only attention is to express. I remember when the last year doing all the protests and everything, just deleting my social media for a season. You know what I mean? Not wanting to have the conversation of being black and the black experience. Yeah, when I was at the park, I had friends, we had the conversation, but it wasn't like a pulling conversation. It was like, yo, y'all the homies, allow me to vent. You know what I mean? And I, right, you done venting? Yeah, let's go skate. Cool.
You know what I mean? Because as soon as my feet is on the board, none of that stuff matters. You got the world burning right now. Cool, y'all go burn. Me and my homies gonna learn these tricks. Me and my homies gonna get these clips. Me and my homies gonna create a place where we can vent without judgment. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Style matters in skateboarding. White or black, green, yellow. If your style is trash, it's like, dang, he needs to go work on such and such and such. But if you're just coming in open-minded, hey, I skate, I'm trying to learn, yo, come on. I enjoy Carter Jones, because Carter Jones, to me, is like the training grounds. Everybody there is good. Everybody who is there is willing to teach. Yo, but you just did a 50-50 on that rail. I'm having a hard time doing that. How did you do that? Now I got a friend. There you go. This is the vibe every Sunday. It's a community. It's an open-minded, diverse, come as you are, you're protected community. If you go to whatever skate park, you're not going to see one race. You're going to see multiple. When Martin Luther King talks about the character and getting to know the character before race, you know, that's skateboarding. <laughs>